next question. I'm trying to teach my 18-year-old son to do laundry. He just doesn't seem to care if the clothes come out right. How do I teach him to care about things he really doesn't care about? Another great question. I know. This one is so good. And I have an older brother on the spectrum. So I literally, when I read this, like popped into my head of my brother and my mom, like fighting about laundry. Um, <laughs> so with all of this stuff, like I always, especially with their teens and adults, I try to ask myself, like, what is the reason we even do these things? Um, so I was just thinking for laundry, mostly the reason I do it is social significance. Like, I don't want people to see my dirty clothes. I don't want people to see me stinky coming into work. Like, it's a really a presentation thing. Um, same with, like, ironing your clothes. Like, personally, I don't care if things are wrinkly, but I know that that would be something I wouldn't want to present coming to work. Um, so if the social significance for our adults isn't there and we're probably working on that but it's not there and we need to get this laundry thing going now um kind of similar to the first one i'd say have laundry be the key to unlocking another really preferred activity um and this it could be small I, we did recently for one of our teens like if she did 10 clean shirts then she could have one of those little packs of pokemon cards um so yeah making that really the key to unlock something else because if the social piece isn't there we're going to need some outside motivation yeah i what a wonderful way of looking at it too because we forget that there are certain things in our day that we just do um, that are not particularly our interest or, or what we're in love with but we do them because there's some sort of a feedback for us that's worthwhile uh, sometimes, right. sometimes it's a treat or sometimes it's avoiding a pain point or whatever, but we do them. And we sort of forget that with our mm -hmm. teens on the spectrum, that they need to have something too, and that it can be something completely unrelated, but we just keep pairing it with it. Um, and, and then hopefully, uh, eventually they will care a little bit more about it because they will like, I mean, clean clothes feel better on your body than rumpled totally. dirty clothes, right? So let's hope yeah. that eventually it transfers. Thanks for watching Autism Live. To subscribe, click here. And if you'd like to check out some more of our videos, click here.